hi guys welcome back to my channel if you are new here my name is Lydia um, so it is Saturday morning and if you have been following my channel you know I typically only vlog on weekends because I do work a nine to five and I don't feel like I've talked about it on here too much but I am a teacher's aide at a private preschool um, the school specializes in autism and I've been working there for about nine months now yes and it's pretty much been a dream job for me I absolutely love it but anyways that is why I do not typically vlog during the week I just stay super busy I am 12 weeks into my second um, competition season um, if you're new here I guess you wouldn't know but I do bikini competitions and I'm prepping for a spring show so that's been super exciting but um, Alex and I are getting ready to head to a new little coffee shop um, so I'm super excited about that but I figured I would just bring you along my morning and yeah I guess the whole day also I have a lot of things that are changing um, for the last two years I have followed macros and I followed macros through my entire last competition season but I have some very big changes coming with that and I'm not ready to talk about it yet but um, one thing I will say is this is my last weekend ever of this competition season of following macros so I'm also going to try to like a full day of eating show you guys what I've been eating before things get switched around and there won't be much variety so anyways I'm going to go get ready to go get coffee with my man and I'll bring you guys along. I know in my last vlog I talked about my daily greens that I've been taking every single morning for the last, um, it's almost been a month now. But anyways, as of yesterday, I am officially an ambassador for their company, which is super exciting because um, I'm just obsessed with these products. I'm blown away by them. And it's kind of like a little dream come true that I get to be part of their company because I love their products. And this one specifically has been life-changing for me and that's no exaggeration I've had so many stomach issues like I talked in my previous vlog and it's still helping me nothing has changed I'm just as regular when I take this so yeah if you ever want to give it a try especially if you have constipation issues and you're looking for something to hopefully be life-changing for you um, I do have a discount code that I will put in the description below and if you use that discount you get a 10% and then it supports me and it would be super helpful especially because I'm new to this I'm new to working with them and so I don't really have a lot of people using it with code so also I'm sorry for the loud noise I have my washer that's off balance right now going crazy so anyways I'm gonna take my greens now and be happier and I'll see you guys in a minute you're like a circle that floats around me keeping me safe and sound and when I fall you've tied a rope to me you're blessing me every day I was down with an illusion like a sparrow with Getting back up on my feet That you showed up Was written in my palm You are a statement Explode like a bomb I get to push myself To victory You make me winner You got me loose And set me free You make me win In every way You showed me how to spread my wings Yes, I'm the winner getting in my car um, Alex and I are driving separately because we both are going different places afterwards um, after coffee and I feel like on the days that I like feel like we have our plans a hundred percent set in stone of like where we're going to get coffee and what time we're gonna be there and what time we're gonna stay there till I feel like those are the days that things just get so thrown off <laughs> so instead of going to we were gonna go to Tula's which I've never been there before and I've been really wanting to go there but it's just ends up not 
it's not gonna work today so we're just gonna go right down the road to Panera because that will give us more time and I want to go to Tula's on a day where it's not like rushed at all and I can really enjoy it so yeah I'm gonna drive and meet him now and while we're at Panera I'm actually going to work on editing my last vlog so I can have it up either this afternoon or this evening I really like to have my vlogs out either like Saturday evening or Sunday morning especially Sunday morning or I just get stressed about it and I don't like when they sit too long <laughs> so I don't know I also feel like I'm just a little bit stressed out I had plans to meet with different people and nothing's going as planned today but it's okay I'm not gonna let it mess up my day because I look forward to my weekend all week so it's gonna be a good day I might be decorating for Christmas or going Christmas or shopping so I'm excited and I'll see you guys I'll see you guys in a minute all right you guys so Alex and I just got done at Panera and I'm at Aldi's now getting ready to get some groceries and of course right as I start this video somebody pulls in right next to me okay I decided to just wait a minute since I was so I'm so awkward always but anyways we just got done at Panera and I'm at the grocery store now but real quick I'm not somebody that like normally complains but I've been spoiled by good coffee and I haven't had Panera in a hot minute and it tasted like a fourth a cup of coffee with all the rest being water and it was disgusting and I took two drinks and I was just done so that was a huge bummer and now I'm going to take my gift card and I'm going to go right on over to Starbucks <laughs> because that was a bummer and I have lots of errands to run. But so my plan is right now, I'm going to go in Aldi's, get th some things because I'm in charge of all the desserts for our friends giving party tomorrow, which I'm super excited about. So I'm going to get some stuff for that. I think one of my friends requested banana pudding, which is so random to me, but I'm going to do that gonna do chocolate pie and then possibly a pumpkin tort so I need to run in the store and get all the things for the desserts and then a few groceries for the week um, I'm kind of trying to finish up like my odds and ends grocery wise since this is my last week of macros and I don't know what my future meals will be just quite yet so I'm trying to finish off everything at the house and I'll just pick up a few things here for the week so not much of like a grocery haul today but then after that, I'm gonna get my coffee and I think Claire's gonna come to TJ Maxx with me. So we'll see. And then after that, I'm running back home and I'm gonna clean, do a little bit of Christmas decorating and bake. So I also have to go to the gym today. I really need to do cardio, like my steady state and my hit. So I need to do that, so let's go. Okay, you guys, I just walked in the door and I'm super out of breath right now, so don't mind that. But I just, I just need to show you guys that it's raining outside and I'm one of those people I refuse to take multiple trips so I just carried all of this up to the third floor I know it doesn't look like much but guys these are freaking jam-packed and it was heavy also can we talk about the fact that I went to TJ Maxx literally just for my coffee syrups this is my second favorite and I've def I've officially decided since I've tried like literally every single flavor this is the ultimate winner for coffee yes just for coffee but yeah I've tried a lot also guys I'm freaking out with the excitement oh don't want to show that but my sorry okay my bill bars came in and I don't even think I've mentioned this at all but I'm officially an ambassador for built bar they wrote me last week and oh my coffee from earlier they wrote me last week and asked if I would be interested in working with them and I just switched over like I was saying um, I left core nutritionals and I switched over to morphogen nutrition which I'm super excited about I feel like so many changes are coming in I don't know this season I feel like everything that I did have is different <laughs> when it comes to like macros and um, companies that I'm working with so I left core nutritionals just because I wasn't really using their products anymore because I've been looking for something more natural 
and I can go into this, I'll go into this in a little bit because I have other news to update you guys on. But I wasn't using their products as much and I'm just somebody who, if I'm, if I'm truly not using their products, there's no way that I feel good about promoting them. And I just wasn't promoting them anymore. So it was just kind of that awkward, like, I'm still with them, but I never post about them and I'm taking other supplements from a different company. So anyways, Morphogen was something I didn't really think would get to happen and it did happen. And it's super exciting. And they don't, um... They don't do like snacks or anything like that, like it's just supplements. But Built Bar has been a company that I've been so impressed with. I tried them over the summer and freaking love them. Um, I literally was posting every day about them and I'm not, like it wasn't because I was sponsored or anything. I just was like, okay, if you've tracked macros and you're looking for something to like take care of your sweet tooth cravings and everything else, eat a Built Bar. I just love them. So. They wrote me earlier this week and the box is already here. So I'm going to open this up and show you guys what I got. And yeah, I don't even know what to expect. So we're going to find out. Alright, so I just cut the box open. And it looks like they sent me one of their mixed like variety boxes. I'm bring it over here. Oh my gosh! This is a huge freaking box. Oh my gosh. Vanilla chocolate cream. Uh, banana chocolate cream. Oh, this is one of my all-time favorites. Orange dark chocolate. This is my very favorite. Mint brownie delight. Black cherry chocolate. I've, I've never tried that one. Ooh, guys, my nails are disgusting. I'm sorry. Dark chocolate mousse. I think there's some more in here. Double chocolate mousse. Oh, it wasn't dark chocolate. It was double chocolate. Oops. Oh, I like this one too. Raspberry chocolate cream. Oh, I don't want to try this one. Not this one. This one. The chocolate coconut cream. That is so exciting. Ah. You guys, this just made my day. Ah, I'm just really excited about this. This is one of those things like I just didn't think was gonna happen. And then I got an email and I'm so excited. How many bars are in here? This is a freaking big box for free. Dang, I don't know, but this is gonna last me a long time. I'm really excited. I've never even, I, okay, I think I let Alex have one. No, I didn't. I didn't. I shared half a bar. <laughs> I just love him so much and he doesn't track macros. So I was like, these are too damn good to share if you can eat whatever you want. But I'm not going to be like that anymore and I'm actually going to share. I'm so excited. I'm really excited. Okay, I'm going to stop being annoying. I'm going to put my groceries away. Then we're going to get to cleaning the house and then it is dessert baking time okay i just got done doing um like a little review for the built bars um on instagram because i wanted to make sure i did that since they sent me that whole box for free but i just opened the i think it's just chocolate coconut yeah coconut chocolate cream and i opened this one because this is one of the very few i haven't tried i've literally tried almost all of them because like i said i had an addiction but um, I hadn't tried this one, and I also haven't tried the black cherry. So I opened this one. It it literally tastes like an Almond Joy. So if you like Almond Joy, give it a try. But if you don't like coconut flavor, don't try this one because it's very coconutty. It's just like a candy bar. I miss these. I haven't had them in like a full month. All right. I'm going to go eat this. Put my groceries away. And then make some lunch because the only thing I've had today so far is I got a bagel at Panera. And then I didn't end up going and getting coffee. I went to Kroger and I was like, oh, I'll just get the coffee. The Starbucks that they have in Kroger because they used to have like an, a shop. Like they do at most grocery, like at a lot of grocery stores. But I don't know why they took it down. And I've been to that one many times and they got rid of it. So I haven't had my coffee yet. And I didn't have any at Panera because it was disgusting. So I'm going to go make coffee. Because I really need it. I'm going to eat. 
All right, so I laid out most all of my ingredients that I need for the, I'm making two separate desserts as of right now. So I made ginger snap cookies last night while Alex was asleep. We were trying to watch a movie and he fell asleep within 20 minutes. So I just left while he was sleeping and I baked ginger snap cookies. I made, I think, three dozen worth of like the dough, but I put it in the freezer because um, I wasn't sure when I was going to cook it. And I think I'm going to make like split it in half and cook a dozen for the party tomorrow. And then I'm also in charge of bringing dessert on Thanksgiving Day for my in-laws. So I'll cook up half the dough that day too. So if you hear noise in the background, I am watching a vlog currently. But I real quick want to show you guys my ingredients. Um, I'm making a cream cheese like pumpkin roll. Um, and then I'm also making banana pudding, which is very interesting, but that's what they requested. So I have my flour and sugar and cream cheese and bananas and then vanilla wafers. And I just got Kroger brand because I'm cheap. But um, yeah, I've got my pumpkin, some of my spices I need to get out, like my cinnamon stuff. And then butter. This is for the banana pudding as well. Um, I'm going to use up some of this milk before it expires. Don't look at the date. <laughs> no, but it, it hasn't expired yet. Anyways, that's some of my ingredients. Those are the ones I, I just had to pick up all of this today. And then the rest I will get out in a minute. But yeah, I just want to show you guys real quick before I get started. And I also have my lunch going real quick. Um, coffee over there. But yeah, I also just brought this mixer over from my family's house. I had it stored in the basement and I haven't used it like at all since I moved back to Ohio. So I'm super excited to use that. But I just have egg whites, five egg whites, some spinach. I have my fat free cheese out and my deli meat and I'm just gonna make an omelet. I don't need too much, especially because I just had that built bar. But yeah, that's it for right now. All right, so I'm in my cozy clothes and I have my cup of coffee, my egg white omelet, and then I just started the banana pudding. I decided I've never made banana pudding, and in case something craziness happens and I fail, I'll just go to the other one and get back to this one. So banana pudding is going up first. I have my Grey's Anatomy. I'm also kind of decorating for Christmas, kind of, while I'm cooking. I'm just doing everything at once. But yeah, I'm gonna eat while I cook. And I hope that everything turns out because my friends requested this one, so there's no turning back now. The roll part of the pumpkin roll in the oven cooking and now I'm working on the filling which is like a cream cheese powdered sugar and so once the roll is done I think it has like 14 minutes left I'll just let it fully cool because if you don't let it fully cool when you go to roll it it cracks so I'm gonna let it fully cool and then I will spread the cream cheese filling um, on top of it and then you slowly roll it up and then I We'll take it off the paper, put it on a cute little plate or something, and then you dust uh, powdered sugar over it. But yeah, I'm just gonna do that. I also need to pack up to go. I'm gonna try and leave, what time is it? It's 4.15 now, I'm gonna try and leave at five o'clock to get to my in-law's house since we're dog sitting for what used to be my puppy. Um, they adopted my dog since we live in an apartment on the third floor and they have a fenced in a very large backyard. Anyways, we're house sitting for them for the weekend and a few days over the week. Um, but yeah, I'm going to get ready to head over and see Alex and we're going to have dinner together. And 
and just hang out. I don't know how much more I'll vlog. I'm obviously going to clean up around here and then I'll show you the final products for the dessert. And yeah. I also, I realize you guys aren't going to miss much when I switch over from doing uh, macros because when I say I'm going to do like a full day of eating, I literally never remember to actually show you guys what I'm eating or I'm just filming and eat like crap the whole day. So, it's not going to be that big of a switch when I do make this switch. So, yeah. I guess that's all I have for right now. I'm going to start cleaning my house because it's a mess now from all the cooking. Alright you guys, so almost all the way done with baking now. This is my little dough ball that I was talking about and this is the ginger snap dough. I still need to like wait till it thaws out a little bit because I had it in the freezer. And then I'm going to roll it into individual little balls and I roll it into a cinnamon sugar. And then I'll cook those and then this needs wrapped up but this is a pumpkin cream cheese roll and I added a little bit of cream cheese on top this time which I don't normally do because I wanted it to look a little extra pretty and it needed some more cream cheese so that one's done and then this is the banana pudding and then I also made a little baby dish well, I guess it's not that tiny but I made a little bit one and that one is just for Alex because he is allergic to bananas so it's like a vanilla pudding and wafers so yeah, those are the desserts, and I need to pack everything up for tomorrow. Anyways, yeah, I think that is all for today. I normally continue my vlogs into Sunday, but I know that tomorrow's just going to be pretty crazy. We have church, and then I mean Michaela to lift, and then... I don't know the order for sure, but then we have our friends giving tomorrow, and I know we're going to be there for several hours, and then I have, like, cardio and hit that needs done, because I, I just decided I'm going to do it tomorrow and take a day where I'm just not in the gym at all, because I feel like I just need that every once in a while, so I'm going to save the gym so that I'm excited to go tomorrow, and I only have one session of hit and steady state left, so it's not putting me behind at all. But yeah, I think I'm just going to end the vlog here, and then I know I had told you guys that I have a lot to talk about, and I think it's just too much for me to try and, like, do today, because I feel like my mind just a little bit all over the place with, like, the day in general, and then just how much there is to talk about. So I think my next vlog is just going to be a full sit-down, fill you guys in on everything, because, like I said, this prep is just very different than last prep and there's been a lot of new changes a lot of things I'm really excited about I think I think this season is just going to take me I'm just going to be at a totally different level than last season so I'm, I'm really excited about that but yeah I think that's all there is for today I'm going to go Alex is actually at home or at the other house cooking dinner so that's fun I don't have to do that um but yeah, I think we might be getting our Christmas tree tomorrow too. I'm not for sure. Not for sure on that. I did want to vlog that, but if it is tomorrow, I probably won't vlog that then. But yeah, I'm going to go just relax and edit this vlog. And yeah. Anyways, thanks so much for watching, you guys. Um, it's really fun to me to see the likes and know that you guys are enjoying it um so if you made it through to the end of this video like always if you could give this video a thumbs up it really does help and if you aren't subscribed make sure you do that so you guys stay up on what's happening in this prep journey but i hope you guys have a good day good night whenever you're watching this and i will see you next week